emissions over the past eight years? Yeah, I, I think, um, you know, as much as people talk about Australia and the USA, there's a lot of other teams in the mix there, but there is a rivalry now, I think especially because a lot of us are playing in the WNBA and we are gaining that experience from playing with and against these American players and um, it's really improved our game, I think definitely. We also have so many players playing in Europe, um, sometimes with, sometimes against American players as well. So um, we've gained a lot of experience right throughout our team and um, it's helped us um, also, maybe we've been exposed to them a little more, so they know our games also. But it, there's a rivalry there, and I think just purely the, the talent of all um, of both teams is a, a very high level. How much quality basketball gone up in your time in, in the international game? Oh, a, a huge amount. I think um, worldwide, it's just improving every um, you know every tournament. You see great improvements in all teams. I think China's one that's really improved over the last four years. Um, and teams like Belarus, Latvia are really stepping up and I've seen uh, amazing steps forward for them. Uh, especially for us, like I said, playing all over the world, the girls are getting great exposure. Tell me, who's the best player in the world right now, women's basketball? Uh, I'd go with Lauren Jackson. You'd stay with Lauren? Yeah, I'd stay with Lauren. Not just because she's my teammate, but she's just dominating. I mean, she's playing the best basketball ever. She's um, you know, had a period of time where she hasn't had any major injuries and she's been able to just get better and better and um, she's unbelievable, she's unstoppable. What is it that makes that package so special? If you've got to break down that package, what is it? I think just the fact that she's six foot five, she's an all round player, she can play as a guard if she wanted to and um, take the ball on the dribble, she can shoot the three, she's so, so determined and I think her mental toughness is what makes her so good. Finally on the Australian team, talk a little bit about the role that Jan Sterling has played in getting the, the girls to this level as the reigning world champs leading into the Olympics as one of the co-favourites to win it all. Yeah, I think um, especially the work she's done at home just to, to get all the players together and have that sort of preparation. Um, you know, obviously with everyone playing all over the world that's not easy so she's had to develop the other players in Australia and in, in the time that we've been waiting for people to get back but definitely um, you know, she's kept the program um, in, at a, its respectable level and, um, you know, done a fantastic job.